All right, y'all. We got to catch them first thing this morning. I'm putting some rods out right now as we speak. Like, I mean, train wrecked them in the first period. We caught 30 pounds day one. If we're gonna win, we're gonna need one of those epic moments, epic mornings that you just, you know, if I had caught everything that I had caught or it did day one of the day one of the tournament, I probably could have caught 40 pounds. If that can happen this morning, and then we can go two fish here, two fish there. I'm not catching numbers. I'm catching quality big ones, in it. and it's just part of the deal. Like I gotta, I gotta catch a really big one. Gotta catch multiple big ones really quick and early this morning. And I gotta maintain. So that's the game plan. I'm rigging stuff up right now. Got the last minute stuff. I'm gonna rig up and then take it to the pond. Hundred degrees. Ugh. Uh, if you have one. Yeah, that's All right, y'all, we are tightening everything up, getting everything together. Beautiful morning here on Lake Travis. Sun's just about to come up. See y'all out there. <laughs> she roared at you. Roar? It's game time. You know what that means? Let's go make this thing happen. Hopefully we can make it happen on this backside. It's interesting how they set up every day. It's a little bit different. I'm looking, there's obviously not as much wind today and that was a huge thing that helps me day in and day out. But it's also just a rotation. If you can get on that rotation, the right little, the right little stretch, when they're high in the water column, you don't need much wind. It's just if you hit it right on their head, Dengar. There's a lot of carp spawning over there too, but they're smaller, man. I'm not catching them big ones today. Let's weigh that one just for real quick. I mean, it's a one five, but that's one one four. One pound, four ounces. Yeah. I just sort of felt like he was that, but I just I've not been catching very many little ones, and so. <laughs> Did it keep? Did it keep? Did it keep? Do we know? We are literally right here. Jacob's like, I don't know, 30, 30 yards away. Adrian's like, he got one. But there's a delay. We're like, we know he did. A little know what one. <laughs> but it's on here too. I just found out it's like 30 seconds delay on this thing here. They're making TV magic. One pound, eight ounces. I was gonna say, that one right there looked like it a one eight. Not the one we're after. Well, we'll take those for sure. That's easy. Dang gum. We'll take them. But we didn't, that's not the kind we're gonna need to win. For sure. I was figuring a little bit bigger for the first one, but I'll take him. Let's ride. 
I'm not going far. Here we go. One pound, 12 ounces. Yes, sir. Keep going. That sucker was up there. I tried, he was on, I saw him try to get it, and I dropped it, and sure enough, dunk, got we need them really big ones to, to win this thing today. Like those are nice fish and all, but, and every one's gonna matter, but we gotta get a couple of those five pound bites probably to win. I know it, it's like it's just, that's how it is up here, it's the nature of the beach. You're not gonna get a turn bike. Make sure my stuff is not. We're not going far, we're just gonna pop up. Oh, good one. Goodness. Two pounds, 13 ounces. Yes, sir. There you go, he's blind in one eye. Whew, there we go. Update. Well, he's gonna sucker punch you. Update. Um, Jacob, we think, just caught a big one. Kara was taking a leak. Kara was taking a leak, so we missed it. But maybe that's the key today. We're, we're waiting for Brought JT and Marty to stop talking so they can show it. So we're all gonna start chugging water and then hopefully the, <laughs> that's the lucky charm. By the end of the day, the live was gonna be full. full. <laughs> Get out to all right, I call it, I call it, he's gonna catch one. <laughs> <laughs> yup, big it. Oh, it's three, we'll take it. three and a quarter. Good one. He's leading. Okay. Blind to one eye. Mark Daniels chewing. Mark and his crocs. He's 110. It's definitely not 110. It's about 170. Wow. Messed that one up. It should almost be a guarantee. Hit those other two. Oh, big fish, Bobby Lane. Bobby ain't no joke. catching the big ones. Ounces. Golly. Pitched it right into his mouth. Literally, pitched it right into his mouth. Saw him, I was like. Yeah. 
Yeah, let's go, boys. Let's go, boys. There's another big one I saw in there, probably a five pounder just sitting there. Pitch that cigarette. Right. 10 ounces. 210. God. Yeah, I saw that son of a gun. You dang sucker. He went, doop. I said, yes, sir. All right. Slow and steady wins the race. We got to hang blast out the dang gates off the first period. We need another big one. We need two big ones. Last little bit, man. We got like 20 minutes to do it, too. Gotta keep it going. One, two, three. Yeah, March has called a 3-6. That's his biggest one of the tournament, I believe, so far. So currently, right now, I got Jacob in first, Mark in second. The team! <laughs> <laughs> That's the end of the period. I'm gonna re-rig some rods. We got a we got a flotilla out here today, rooting us on. We got some work to do though. I'm gonna sort of see what I'm, I'm anticipating. We're gonna sort of see what happens in that second period. I I'm not exactly sure. Oh boy, I just man, I never really had the bites. But I will probably run back to that marina dock later, just because that wind's starting to blow on it now. Rather than washing it and having everybody, you know. I figured I would work and then just go down this stretch dock, so that's where it goes down too. And they seem like they're still up pretty high. That's He's just hanging there. The poor bear. <laughs> He's like, well, I think I think Pete pushed him over or something. No. Oh, Pete! <laughs> Pete! I Pete! I heard. I heard that. Pete's like. I wonder why you said you're still going fast. You had Pete. I know, right? I don't know. He's just a little guy. Dude, I ran 69.3 uh, this morning. Do I have a snack? I have, a, I have something. What do you need? Anything. We'll take anything. Everything you're willing to give up. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Nothing you need to prepare for anything. Or... Oh my gosh. Hmm? Oh, no. <laughs> what is it? I got him at Academy. Thanks, babe. That's a good little academy plug. Like, I skip and I hear because like, they're on the dang top of the water. And I don't. Hey, we are going to end up cutting out before the break. Okay. So, give her hell. I appreciate it. Crappie. Crappie. <laughs> Crappie. How many we have? Seven bass. I mean, yesterday that's all I caught was seven, and they were all freaking big. Yeah. So cute. Come on. <laughs> I mean, three, four, five pounder, I don't know. <clears throat> that thing big. We needed that one bad. It wasn't really anything fundamentally we did wrong. It just, it just come off. Yeah, boy. Good job, yeah, boy. Man. I've been two docks in a row of us. Pounds, five ounces. Yes, sir. That was two bites in those two dogs, man. 
Big top water bite, I'll be all right. I can get him in the boat. Yeah, boy. All right. I'm waiting for them big ones, but I'll take every one of these until they come show up. Thank you. Ounces. Probably what it is, I didn't caught most all the big ones, and now they can, the little ones can finally get up there and feel comfortable. They're like, oh heck no. I'm coming back down this stuff. Had three bites on this stretch. All right, that's cool. What does that see? I tried like, I tried hard to find them out offshore yesterday. Didn't find them. Yes, sir. There we go. Got a little. And I was like, man, there's no way I'm not. Eight ounces. There we go. Not not a giant one, but man, that's good to see. It's exactly what I was sort of anticipating to figure it up in the day. I could go with this wind that's actually happening right now. I figured I could catch a couple on top. I haven't run down a lot of the stretches that I caught them on the first day, and so I think I could. The dock bite seems to die off a little bit more, but you can still catch a few. But together, I feel like you can make it happen. I've run new water doing this, but I haven't run the water that i gotten bit off of really and taken my time going down the stretches. Boom, baby. There we go. There we go, boys. Three pounds, five ounces. All right, y'all. You ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you sure you're ready? Are you guys ready? I'm here to hit the igloo. Let me hear it. It's not, it's a little, that's a little ding. It's a little ding. That's fair enough. See you later, buddy. Pete's been sitting on the igloo, is what it is. It's okay, Pete. You gotta, you gotta watch out for that, that bell. You know, you can't mess it up. It's, I'm just kidding, Pete. <laughs> now, Pete and I got behind the camera. Last time we were together, we, we won a derb. Now we gotta, we gotta do it again. That one right there, whew. That was, I like that. Get. Maybe. Let's weigh him real quick. One pound, seven ounces. Tried him. I mean, he was right there, too. Unreal. So, a lot of the people out there watching along and following along, see some of the cast I'm making. I'm actually using the 7.3. This is my 7.3 medium heavy action rod. But if you're learning, trying to learn how to skip and cast, get better, I would definitely recommend going to a seven footer at first. You wanna make sure you have a super free reel. If you can't make those casts, this is like by far the best reel that I've, best reel that I've had used as far as being free. It's actually a little signature series reel of mine that uh, actually is only available at Academy right now. It's, it's a Ducket Paradigm casting reel. And dude, this sucker just, ooh. Wind's blowing on that dock pretty good. I'll, I'm gonna slide over here and be done with it. And sort of, I might have to hit it pretty quickly, but I gotta hit it. Watch out! 30 seconds. That's not a bass. Okay. Let's get our 
got somebody's crankbait it looks like well we got to definitely get it done this last period solid period lost you know one fish but we're, we're on track we just got to make it close it out in this last period all right y'all we are only what six pounds up or so six something up right now and we got to close this period out strong we had 24 pounds i believe I believe uh, Bobby, Big Fish Bobby Lane's got 18 something, so, or 17, 18 something. I'm swapping my line out, making sure everything's good to go. Did have one that broke me off, that probably pound and three quarter, most close to two pounder, but hey, we're gonna try to give ourselves the best opportunity to win this final period. And you guys are coming along with us. Wish us luck. Now, I'm gonna hit this this little bit of community dock right here. But the wind was not blowing at first either, so that's why I'm like, mm. could be a couple of them slid up high in the water column. Little. No. Nope. Non scoreable. I like the fact that I can still throw a top water and sort of mix it up. Just waiting. I had two bites on this dock the first day. Since then, I've not caught them. When you get a bite on a dock, there's normally a few that live there, and you can always go back and catch a couple of them. Pretty decent one right there. Just didn't get it. But at least we're getting some bites. I think I don't know if that one went over there and grabbed it. I couldn't see him. That one probably did, but that's why I was like, oh heck no. If I let him settle down, I might be able to. Gosh, there he is. Boom, baby. Yes, sir. That's the kind you need. Whoo! There we go. We can do it. Two pounds, eight ounces. There you go, two and a half pounder. It's a huge fish right now. Two and a half pounder, baby. <laughs> Let's freaking go, boys and girls. That, man, that's what I'm saying. I know, I know I can catch on that plop. The problem is, those fish, they have to either go up there and crush it like that one did, or they just come there and slap it. I've literally had six bites on it today. It's horrible bites, and I've caught three. So it's not little one right there. Oh, itty bitty. Guadalajara. We need a three. We need, a, we need to catch 30 pounds. I'm telling y'all, 30 pounds, the magic number. I got some of that big sucker messing with them bluegill. I think. Boom, baby, yes! Yeah! There we go. That's what I'm talking about. I was about to run by that dock and I saw that bird sitting there. Oh, come on, sorry, buddy. Got him in the tongue. Two pounds, two ounces. Yes, sir. There we go. I just saw that bird up there on that dock and I'm like, mmm. Just gave me a little bit of a clue. And I'm like, well, I gotta, I gotta make a couple casts. The water stained up just a little bit right here. Had a little bit of wind. And it was just from that muddy bank. I don't think that fish got as good a look at it. Look at that snake right there. Maybe not. Oh, yeah, water moccasin, maybe. See him? Uh, no, it's inch one four. One pound, three ounces. Pound. Yeah. He, he, he even needed to eat. It was like a one four, a one three. It was just long. another about a two and a half pounder or so to have a good shot at it I think so it's not changed on the Bobby the change it guy telling you it's gonna happen we got to get it done one big one man one big one already know 
my bite was better in the mornings, his bite was better in the afternoons. I knew, I figured it was gonna be a, no matter who won, it was gonna be a dang battle. I had to go back down the stretch that I had multiple bites down. Favorite part right now? Favorite part? Yeah. I mean, it's just, the whole thing just sucks sometimes. <laughs> My heart's racing. Oh my god. The, I'm literally like, I probably need to calm down. Unbelievable. Two minute warning to two hours to three. Longest 30 seconds of my entire life. Now it's the longest 15 seconds of my life. We did it. Congratulations. You're the Austin awesome <laughs> Stage 2 champion. Unreal. Unbelievable. Wow. We grinded all day long. Man, that was un unbelievable. Had one fish that ended up breaking my line, and I just, man, I, I knew I had to have a good first and second period. And hold on, I gotta see my, my wife. Are we good? I don't know what to do. <laughs> Yay, babe. Holy crap. Okay, I'm scared. Come on. Oh my God, good job. Oh my god, I was freaking out. <laughs> I trust me, I was too. Holy crap, I'm uh, so sorry. <laughs> I'm so, I'm so that's awesome. Oh, Unbelievable. I can't. That's so nuts. I know last minute. Oh my gosh. I thought I needed one more. I almost so was positive. I. And it was so <laughs> close. I, I was just like score tracker up there. I know. I'm like, I need to catch a three pound, you know, dang get to 30 pounds. Oh, babe. I can't. Oh. oh. Unreal. Thank you so much for coming out. Yeah. That was thing crazy. Yeah. Yeah, I'll let you hop back in there. I'm going to go say to Newell. Dude, that's so awesome. We're going to do a real quick interview. No problem. You stay in your question. Just okay. Mm -hmm. That's fine. Closest margin of victory. <laughs> Two ounces. I know. Tell us where you're at, right? I now. still got a dang. I still my heart pounded so fast. It's just unbelievable, man. I uh I Yeah, I guess. Just right there. That was the I knew it. I was like right there. I knew I put I put less gas there so I could get up there faster. I didn't get enough. I ran out of gas. Literally ran out of gas. Is that Rob? Yeah. <laughs> Let's see if we can't catch one. They're fine. We're not far away. Yeah, it's like literally. If I was gonna run out of gas, running out of gas right there is where it's at. Welcome everyone to Major League Fishing's The Bass Pro Tour. The man next to me can finally <laughs> breathe. Today, I, I also knew that my last period was my nemesis. I could not generate that many bites, but I knew those guys down the lake, you know, were catching them consistently all day long. So, 10 out of 10. Like, I, I knew, I knew I had to go through my progression. I knew I had to get to each place and really maximize my time. I tried to mix my rotation up, and I heard they were very pressured. They knew sort of what was up. I had some knock my, knock my bait this morning, and I'd hook up for a second be good ones and just come off, and they were just nipping at it, reacting to it. And so it got tougher as the day went on. I literally could see them in the last period. I could see a couple of fish and I could cast right in front of them and they just look at it and just swim away. Oh, All yeah, right, absolutely. everybody make some noise for none other than the Berkeley. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No, I've lost by
by an ounce, which, which stings really, really bad. You'd rather get blown out every day of the week than losing by a small margin like that. You got it yourself? Oh my goodness. Can you get it all yourself? Yeah, he won a red card. Yeah, he was in oh DC's boat. And he was in my boat when I caught the 50,000 hour bass. No kidding. Yeah, and he was in my boat today when I won. Hitters? Yeah. Oh. How do you do it, man? Where did you get that? <laughs> Lil Marshall. Lil Marshall, you ain't playing, bro. Give me some hot. Give me. Exactly. Heck yeah. I mean, if y'all don't know Lil Marshall, Lil Marshall has won. $450,000 so far this year since we've got him. So he's a very valuable teddy bear. And uh, anyway, so that's the backstory on it. You can look more on the channel. Sweet. He's got teeth marks on all over him. That's the best part. There you go. Awesome. As you can see, he's been eating up. I probably caught, I don't know how many I caught on that. <laughs> You're good, man. No problem. All right, y'all. It's a wrap. We're going to head back, got a bite to eat. I don't know if we're going to close it out here because I got to holler at my boy MDJ. But it was freaking unbelievable. Like by a last minute of oh, two ounce win. One by two ounces margin. Big shout out to Bobby Lane though. Bobby Lane, big fish Bobby Lane. Bobby Lane be catching them always. He descends to. And uh, man, I, I, I feel for him because I know how it feels to lose by a small margin. And so, hey. It is what it is, but it uh, feels pretty dang awesome to get that W, you know what I'm saying? We hoisted, that's so cool. Anyway, so I'm going I'm to check back in with y'all before the night's over, though, because I'm not going to close you out right here quite yet. Big dog. <laughs> Michelle, oh, yeah, you already know what you're going to do. All right. Uh, be last second. Congratulations, bro. Uh, they weren't even like Shad spawning, though. No? It was like a, it was, I, I didn't catch my vibe, I caught it on a chatterbait. On docks. Mm -hmm. Yeah. See, I ran up the pond, second day of practice, uh -huh. and was doing that deal, and I caught a few, but they, the shad was like this big yes. they was eating, and it was weird, and I didn't really But they weren't like, really, like, if you, if you watched the practice vlog, it's not even, it wasn't even good, was it, Rudy? I mean, like, I had a couple bites, but I had enough where so I made knew. You, oh, okay. Like, I knew I'd catch them. Like, I felt like I'd catch them, you know? Like, I knew I could run docks and catch them. Yeah. But I didn't know what I'd catch. And then that first the first place I rolled up to, I caught like hey, smash. I caught three big ones and I lost two big ones. And then I just like you, oh, I gotta show you that video of that thing snake. You caught a snake? No, that one. That, that's not okay. She got lit. <laughs> that's not wearing a dress? No, I wear pants. Oh, that's why. You got lit. Look at oh, I'm like Hey, that's the doc, hey, Dr. Cole, she's not getting enough vitamin D. That's she got it today. <laughs> I did. Man, you lit up. Bad, bad. What are you going to eat? From here up, no, nothing. Yeah, it's all good though. So you put a little nice shirt on and you put some socks on. Sorry. Nobody knows you even got some. Go to the uh, tanning booth. Can okay, you not? Because you're pregnant, huh? No. Oh, I don't be knowing, bro. You know, I'm just trying to help. Anyways. Let's close uh, this video up. Right, let's all do right. that. Secure <laughs> us. Yeah, well, Secure us. All right, y'all. That's the deal. You got third? I got third. Like, I'm holding up two dubs. Why? Cause it's sucking in one every tournament there is. Two dubs. <laughs> hey. Hey, I'll tell you what though. Hey, just for the record. Unbelievable. Hey, for the record. Hey, MDJ has not had Marshall yet. I ain't had Marshall. Hey, 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 bro, I didn't even think about that. Hey, hey, Marshall has yeah. won $450,000 yeah, so bro. far this year. So next With tournament him. you ain't getting Marshall, bro. So next tournament you have it. Yeah, I'm going to let you have him to start off. I'm not... No, we're going for the arm wrestle. I don't, I don't want him. I don't want him in the in the fall of, Yeah, I want him. I want him on knockout and championship, championship. day. Well, hey, we, we might God, we might Lee. we might go figure out. DC stole him on the not on the elimination day one or day number two. Remember did that? He have, who had, oh, did he have him during knockout round? DC? No, no, no he I had, you had him. him. Okay. Uh huh. And he had double cross, bro. See what I'm saying? Like I see the I see the trend, bro. Unbelievable. Yeah, yeah. I got to get Marshall. Hey, that's all I gotta say. Yeah, anyway, I so we we both we killed it. We had a good yeah, time. Yeah, we had a good, good. Top top five, top, top we, three. We ain't got first. that. Hey, but, man, that's awesome though. Hey, you're talking. I'm, I'm gonna bet on MDJ. Watch, watch hey, out for him in Florida. Bro, it's coming, man. I, I I didn't said it before though. You gotta you gotta consistently stay in toward the top. That's in, the thing. In, in order to win, and and we didn't have some close ones. Yeah. But we gotta we gotta stay consistently. Toward that top, so well, as long as we keep it. doing that, it's coming. I ain't worried about it, bro. Yeah, like I had a two thirds this year so far yeah. before I got it, you know, and then even had an opportunity. I almost got a second. Yeah, you know, you the, the key is is more top tens you make, the better you can increase your odds. Yeah, yeah, straight up. That's it's real it simple. Yeah. So at the end of the day, the number game. We just got to make top tens. That's it, man. We'll be Peace there. out, brother. Anyway, one more dub. Hey, congratulations, one more dub for J <laughs> Congratulations, <laughs> to my boy and me, Jay. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. We're gonna go smash some sushi. 
at this yeah, little spot. It's a pretty little spot. Okay. That's a pretty good spot. So put some rolls. Pretty, pretty solid. Hey, yeah, y'all shot J-Dub on sushi after you just wanted dirt? Yeah, not me either. <laughs> No, no. Just wondering if y'all were. All right, y'all. We, we out. Let me let them know everything I'm living, looking like a